What's up guys, Faded Lime here. One year on YouTube, one year exactly to the day was when I first uploaded my first gameplay video. Yes, one year, woo! We've come so far because that first video was in standard definition. And yeah, if you wanna dig through the f videos, you can go check it out, see what I was like a year ago. See if I've really changed all that much. I don't know if I have, I don't think I have. Maybe gotten a little better at talking, maybe a little bit, who knows. So. We were doing a QA. and I probably could have made a video saying I wanted to do a QA. and a This is also my 100th video. Yes, 100th. So like I said, I could have done a video saying I was going to do a and a but I didn't. I used Twitter, so I'm kind of limited. But let's get this started, and I'll be back in a second. So, Rami. <laughs> oh, I love you, man. How much time in a week do you spend staring at moose knuckles? Well, seven. One hour per day. And can you Canadian my bacon? Of course you can Canadian my bacon, my friend. Of course you can. Mr. Tony Stark asks, if you could make one thing legal that wasn't legal now, what would it be and why? That's easy, my friend. I'm Canadian. I would make the death penalty legal because there's too many sickos up here. There's too many sickos everywhere that get to sit and rot in jail. Like, that's supposed to be some sort of discipline. I don't believe in that. If the crime deserves it, somebody should rot or somebody should burn in hell for it. Yo Pittsburgh asks, why is Yo Pittsburgh better than you at COD? That's easy, bud. I have more sex than you do. Beauty question from a beauty. Vivi asks, fave Leaf player. Joffrey Lupel, buddy. Joffrey Lupel. He's been my favorite in the video games since NHL 09, and he's my favorite in real life. London asks, if I had the power, whose channel would I shut down on YouTube? That's easy. The Black Worm. I despise it. His character's annoying, his gameplay's annoying, and he's just shouldn't be where he's at. What do I think of this sexy logo, Pittsburgh? It's pretty sexy, man. I gotta admit. Gaming Ethos asks, have I ever played League of Legends? And if so, what was the champ I used? Or my favorite champ? Uh, I only played it once at a buddy's house, and I used a guy that looks like a uh, dwarf. I don't know, little ginger dwarf, melee guy. It was my buddy's suggestion. Neon Panda asks, what's your favorite thing about making YouTube videos? Simple. The interaction, man. I love answering comments. I love when people leave good comments. That's pretty much the number one reason right there. Interaction. DJ Mog, a Steve Hawking Troll, asks, what's your favorite Ninja Turtle? Raphael, buddy. The asshole with a heart. Love him. Pico210 asks, which album can you listen to from beginning to end? That's simple. The Decline by No Effects. It is one song, 18 minutes, 22 seconds long. Greatest song ever written by anybody. I'm that punk. Chuck's got a two-parter. He asks, what system has caught my eye? None yet, my friend. But I am leaning more and more towards PS4. I don't know why, but I am. And do I ever think it'll be, it'll be too old to game? No. My dad gamed with me when I was when he was in his late 30s and 40s and it's just a kid can bring out the gaming back into you or you can just game for fun for fuck how old you are it doesn't matter it's just fun Wicked Hut asks since I'm Canadian am I familiar with the term milk bag and have I ever seen passing down of the jug no I googled that and I don't even know what the hell you're talking about but milk bags yes we drink our milk in bags uh, I didn't realize other countries didn't actually Swifty Soul asks, what do you enjoy the most about gaming and or the community? Uh, the community, I like the interactions and gaming. It's just usually something that I can do to relax. Unless I'm playing Call of Duty, then it's try hard pants and rage. Steam Machine asks, what made you do comms? The inspiration and favorite game of all time. Favorite game of all time is GTA Vice City. It's all 80s. It's got Ray Liotta. The radio station's fucking kicked ass. Loved it. Uh, the inspiration for this was... Two years ago, I had my face smashed, jaw broken. I was all fucked up, bedridden, couldn't move, couldn't talk, couldn't go out. And I started suffering from social anxieties because I thought I was all fucked up looking. And doing these comms kind of helped me build my confidence back out. And that's more or less why I got into YouTube. That was the inspiration to try to help build my confidence back. So that's it, guys. That's the questions. Thank you, guys. One year. Thank you so much for sticking around, sticking with me. Thank you for the questions. If you guys want me to do another one, you know what to do. 
either, you know, leave it in the comments, leave me some questions in the comments. If you wanted to ask anything, I will get back to you. Till next time, this is Faded Lime, signing off.